Hi everyone, this is Shane R. Monroe with Monroe World, and today we're going to be answering one of your questions from the Oculus Quest subreddit. And the question reads, Will this capture card work for streaming the Quest? I'm wondering if you can uh, take this little cheaper version of the Elgato HD60 to stream. I'd like to have my Chromecast linked into it, and then uh, link it to my graphics card, and then make a source in uh, Streamlabs, OBS, whatever. So any help or alternatives are welcome. Well, uh, one of the answers to that question was um, that it would probably work, but you're going to need an HDMI splitter to strip out the uh, high definition copy protection from the, the Chromecast. So I have also always heard this, but I've never actually gotten around to testing that theory. So what I have is a second generation Chromecast. I've got everything buried over here. I've got a second generation Chromecast. I've got it hooked up. Sorry, it's a little dusty back here. I've got that hooked up to just a simple HDMI switch box, and that switch box is currently outputting to my Elgato, which is, mine's an internal PCI, but it's uh, it's basically an Elgato internal. And as you can see, um, it is powered up, and there's nothing, nothing on the screen other than the fact that I need to clean my screen. Look at that, it's so gross. All right, so um, the question then comes in, well, will the HDMI splitter do the trick? Or is this just a weird configuration of mine that doesn't work? Well, I can assure you that uh, the HDMI splitter solution is indeed required. Now, here's the problem. You have to find one of these that's actually unofficially available to um, strip out copy protection. Because obviously, they're not going to advertise it. You're not going to see it anywhere on the box. There's a million versions of this splitter that look exactly like this one, and you're never sure if the one you're going to get actually has the ability to do that or not. So you better find a trusted source, and I'll do my best to see if I could dig one up for you. Put it in the uh, links below, but do your own research. Don't just assume that because the box looks like this or that the device looks like this one, That it's going to take care of the job because I see hundreds of, of, of these that look like this and people report that they do not work. But do they work for Chromecast? Let's find out. So it just so happens I happen to have one of these little guys right here. It's all plugged in. I am now just simply going to take, and this is going to be great doing this one-handed. Should have got my cameraman in here. All right, so I'm going to unplug my Elgato output. I'm going to plug in the output to send it to the switch box or I'm sorry, to the splitter. I guess we're plugged into the splitter, you see the input. And then it's always HDMI out two that does the uh, protection release. So now I'm gonna just take my Elgato output, as soon as I'm figuring out where I stuffed it, I'm gonna plug it into, oh, this is gonna be a lot harder than I thought. Right, I'm just gonna have to give you guys a little picture of my, there we go. All right, so now you can see we've got some output, the input's in, we're still switched to the Chromecast, and how did we do? The Chromecast is alive, but will it stream to it still? That's the real question. That was the question that was asked. So I'm gonna, I'm gonna put on Mr. Headset here. I'm gonna try to do this through the little hole in the bottom, <laughs> the spot in the bottom here where I can peek through. Let me see if I can go ahead and, hang on. This is harder than I thought it was gonna be. Go to sharing, cast, Shane's Chromecast, next. Oh yeah, yeah it works. Yep, there you go. So the answer to the question is, you can probably use whatever video capture card or video capture device you want, but you will have to remove the high definition copy protection. Yeah, well, not necessarily the answer everybody wants to hear, but certainly, um. It's the answer that you might have needed to see. So let me get this guy over here. This is what I ended up getting. And again, I'm using a Chromecast 2. And uh, I hope you enjoyed the video. So we'll be answering that question. Well, we did answer that question, but we'll uh, post a link to the video for those who are interested in seeing it for themselves. This is Shane Armand Rowe. Thanks for watching.